Greetings! In this video series, we're going to be introducing you to graphics in Python. We're going to be talking about how to use the graphics module we give you to open a graphics window and draw things in it. And then for the rest of this video, we're going to focus on basic drawing functions. So like drawing a square or circle, you know, basically giving you the ability to make a pretty little picture. And in future videos, we'll show you how to animate it, how to control it with the keyboard and mouse, how to do sound effects. Basically, by the end of these lessons, you'll have all the tools you need to build a game. But we're going to start right now on the basic stuff. First things first, in the beginning of the class, we asked you to install a module called Python Graph. And Python Graph is our graphics tool. It was basically a stripped down video game engine, and it was created specifically from CS110 to make graphics very accessible. You can do a lot of things in Python Graph. You can draw creepy little flowers to basically complex animations. In this video, we're going to focus on this side, but uh, eventually you'll be able to do the right side. Using Python Graph is incredibly straightforward. Uh, all you do is you import Python Graph and then you call its various functions to open a window or to draw a picture. So for here, for example, I'm opening the window, I'm specifying the width and the height of that window, and then I immediately get the window. The only weird thing you need to know about Python Graph, and I would foot stop if, you know, if it wasn't a video, is that the top left corner is 0, 0, and the bottom right corner is your um, positive x and positive y direction, all right? So once you know that the coordinate system is flipped, it's pretty easy to find your way around, but you'll it's easy to forget that. So to, once you have a window open, you want to draw. Uh, we've given you a bunch of drawing functions. So here, for example, draw rectangle. We'll go ahead and uh, draw. If you give it the two coordinate uh, corners of the rectangle and the color, it will draw the rectangle for you. And then draw circle. If you give it the center and the radius and a color, it will draw that circle for you as well, all right? To make things very simple for you, we went ahead and created a simple template that uh, will do basically all the setup for you. So here, for example, I'm, it imports Python Graph for you. We specify the screen title, the width and height of the window, and then we automatically open the window and we set the window title. So for example, if I press play here, it opens a window for me. And then this last function down here, wait for close, it basically keeps this window open until the user presses this. And if you don't have this, this is kind of funny. If you do this, you press play, your window basically pops and then it crashes, right? So you have to go ahead and press the stop button. So this one is very important. That's why we give you the template. So like I said, we do a lot of the uh, easy stuff for you. The only thing you need to add is basically here. You add all of your drawing code, whatever you want to draw. And then uh, you keep the blue stuff there and everything will be fine. So now that we've talked about setting up our Python graph window, so how do we actually draw things? Um, in order to draw things, you basically need to know all the drawing functions. And we provided you with multiple resources. Uh, we have a PDF you can download from Canvas that has all the functions, as well as an online resource that explains everything. So here, for example, we're going to show you how to draw a circle. Uh, and according to the documentation, this is what the function looks like. And then down here explains everything. So let's actually go ahead and draw a circle. Um, and I'm going to, actually I'm going to go and find the, here's the draw circle. It's also online, so let's go take a look at it here. Um, if I want to draw a circle, the way that I do it is I say Python graph, because that's the name of the module. And then we say here I want to draw a circle. And then I specify the uh, X and Y coordinates of the circle. So I'm going to pick 2, 320 by 240. I'm going to specify a radius. So let's say 100. And then color. Notice that color could be a bunch of things. Uh, the easiest one here is if you just do it in quotation. So for example, green. Uh, and then uh, if I go ahead and say whether or not it's filled, so this is true or false. So I'll say it's a, a filled in circle. And then here is uh, the width. And width, it says it's an optional parameter. So we'll go ahead and just not put one in and I'll show you what width does in a second here. All right, so if I press play, I have a circle and it's a green circle in the center of my window. So let's actually play with width. Let's say, uh, if I say here false, it should not fill in the circle. So if I do this, I get a circle with just a green line. And that width parameter specifies how thick that line is. So for example, if I say uh, it's a really, really thick line, um, I'll go ahead and press play, and there you go. All right. 
So reading the documentation is very, very useful uh, as a general life skill when you're programming, and Python Graph is our way to teach that skill to you. You can also see an example here of uh, this code here. If you run it, it will work. So you can see here that it has a slightly different way of specifying colors. We give you lots of different ways, so feel free to use the one that works for you. All right. So again, all the parameters are specified, and you need to pay careful attention to when parameters are optional or not. Um, reading the manual is probably the easiest way to do that. So now let's actually draw something. Uh, we have a uh, 640 by 480 window, so we're going to draw a face. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is go back over here. We're going to clear out what we have, and we're going to let's go ahead and just draw that big circle in the middle. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and um, again we're going to draw the circle for our big face. This time I'm going to say 290 by 250, and then I'm going to specify a radius of 100. We're going to make a yellow circle, and we're going to say it's filled in. All right. And again, I'm I'm not you know just memorizing it. I'm looking over here and looking at the documentation and saying, oh, okay, that's what I need. I press play. Notice how I'm testing it each time. That's really really important. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to draw the little eyes, right? So I just happen to know that the coordinate for the first eye is 250, 200. The radius should be 20, and we'll do black for an eye for now. So if I press play, it's looking creepy, we're almost there. We'll do the other eye. And then this one is at 330, 200, again the radius is 20. Instead of specifying the color this way, I'm going to do, uh, there's a color function called Python graph dot create random color, and then um, I'll go ahead and keep saying true. So when I press play here, instead of just drawing a, you know, a standard color, it will just generate a random color for me on the fly. So now he kind of looks like a Bond villain, which is cool. All right. The next thing I need to do is draw the line. So let's go find out how to draw a line um, until we find it. There it is. Draw a line. So draw a line says I need to tell you the. Uh, oh, it's drawing from this x coordinate to this set of coordinates. All right. So Python graph dot draw line, and then I'm going to specify the two ends of the line. So that's the left side, and then that's the right side. I get to specify the color again. So we'll just we'll make a I don't know red lips, and then <laughs> uh, we'll specify a width. So even though it's optional, I'll go ahead and say um, ten. Right, I just want it to be really a really really thick line. So if I press play here, that looks more and more like a Bond villain. So okay, we're good there. So you can see here. And by the way, this is what you all look like when I'm in class. I'm staring at all your faces, just like no amusement or anything. All right. <laughs> so, like I said, there's no uh, easy way to show you everything there is in Python Graph. But I thought this would be a good starting point for you. Uh, you basically have all the tools you need in order to create a graphics window, open up, put some drawings in there, and play around with it. The key to this is going to be this documentation here. This documentation explains everything you need to know about how to draw things, right? Uh, we have tons of drawing functions. So for example here, uh, you can draw a single pix pixel. You can draw text on the screen. Um, I think you can even draw an image. Let's see if we can find that. Uh, yeah, so here for example, you can even draw an image uh, at a place of your choosing. So assuming you had an image called falcon.png in the same folder, you could draw an image. So it's really easy to get started and just playing around with it is how you're going to learn. So that's it. In this video we showed you how to open a graphics window, how to start drawing some things, and then basically showing you the documentation and how to read it. You're not going to be able to learn this without going out there and trying it, so we encourage you. Go out there, give it a shot, let us know if you have any questions, and we'll see you in the follow-on videos. Thanks.